Hello everyone. Today we are gonna see the difference between a modem and a router. Modems and routers are both important devices for connecting to the internet. Many people get confused because they think modems and routers are the same things. However, modems and routers perform their functions in very different ways. Well, here is everything you need to know about the difference between a modem and a router. The main difference between a modem and a router is that a modem connects you to the internet and a router distributes the internet connection to your devices. Router doesn't connect you to the internet by itself. It's important to know the difference between them when setting up your internet and home network. This will help you to properly set up your network and also can help with troubleshooting. Alright, so let's break it down into further details. What does a modem do? Let's have a quick rundown on it. A modem is responsible to make and maintain a dedicated connection between your ISP and the internet. Basically, it's your gateway to the internet. In fact, modem is a device that receives analog signals from the internet and translates them into digital signals that your devices can understand and vice versa. Modem allows your devices to send and receive data over the internet. The term modem comes from the words modulation and demodulation. When the internet was first created, modems were used to modulate or convert analog signals that telephone lines use into a digital signal that computers and other devices can understand. Then a modem would demodulate the signal from your devices back into an analog signal so it could be sent over a telephone line. Most modems have only three ports, one that connects to the power switch, one that connects to the internet, and one that connects to the router. Older modems connect to the internet via telephone lines, while newer ones use cable or fiber optic connections. They have at least one ethernet port to connect to a router or computer. Modems normally include lights on them, so you can see what's going on. One light indicates that unit is receiving power. One shows that device is receiving data. One shows that modem is successfully sending data. Next one shows internet connectivity. And the last one indicates that modem is connected to ethernet port. There are few different types of modems. Analog modems, usually dial up. DSL modems use typical telephone line and cable modems use coaxial cable. Let's talk about a router. A router is a networking device that routes your internet connection from your modem to the devices in your network. This allows you to connect to the internet from your computer, laptop, smart TV, mobile phone and other wired or wireless devices. You can say it is a central hub for your devices. Router sends and receives traffic through the modem with a single connection. They also have at least one ethernet port that needs to be connected to the modem so it can send and receive data from the internet. The main function of the router is to distribute your internet traffic to the correct device in your network. It does this by assigning all your devices an IP address. Moreover, router creates local area network and allows you to manage its settings. With a router, you can enable security settings and manage traffic to certain devices. A router also lets your devices communicate with one another over the network. For example, a router lets you change the settings of your home smart devices by using an app on your smartphone. There are different types of routers available, but the two most common ones are wired and wireless. Wired routers need to be connected to your computers and other devices with a wired Ethernet connection. Wi-Fi routers use built-in antennas to transmit signals wirelessly so you can connect Wi-Fi devices. Most routers have several Ethernet ports that allow you to connect to your devices via Ethernet cable. But modern routers are coming 
with built-in switches that let you connect multiple wired devices. Coming to an end, routers and modems have traditionally been two different devices that worked together to create a home network. However, with today's technology, you don't need a separate modem and separate router necessarily. As a new combination of modem and router, integrate the two devices function into one powerful machine. These multifunctional machines like Xfinity and Ares provide all the power you need to check your emails, stream your TV shows and connect with your smart devices without the hassle of dealing with two separate devices. Pretty awesome, isn't it? Yes, it is. Alright, so this brings me to the end of my video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.